Hi guys, we're gonna make a pepper pot buffalo from start to finish. Hi guys, welcome to Selvin Kitchen guys. Thank you guys to subscribe to Selvin Kitchen. Thank you guys to watching my videos them. And guys, please give me a thumbs up guys when you're watching the video. And please share the video with your friends and family card. When you give me a thumbs up, it help out a lot. And please hit that notification people so when Selvin Kitchen posts a video, you guys will know when Selvin Kitchen gonna post something new. So in Selvin Kitchen guys, we have a pepper pot buffalo steak we're gonna do today guys. So we have two kilo of buffalo meat. We have already washed them already. I'm gonna show you guys how we're gonna slice them up. Over here we have one small red bell pepper. We have a piece of fresh thyme. We have one white onion. We have half of green bell pepper and half of orange bell pepper. We have two small tomato. We have four cloves of garlic. We have a piece of ginger. We have two stalk of spring onion. We have half a tablespoon of ice sauce. We have half a tablespoon of soy sauce. We have three tablespoons of vegetable oil. You can use any type of cooking oil to your preference. You can use olive oil, you can use corn oil. So any type of cooking oil for your preference you can use. Over here we have one tablespoon of flour. You can use the cornstarch. If you don't have flour, use the cornstarch instead. So we have one teaspoon of all-purpose season, we have half a teaspoon of garlic powder, we have half a teaspoon of onion powder. Beautiful recipe in Selvin Kitchen guys coming up guys. Beautiful, delicious recipe. Yes people, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna slice up this, this buffalo meat. So I just leave a little bit of fat on it guys. You cannot take off all of the fat off your meat because your meat gonna be dry, your meat gonna be like trashy like. You don't want to dry meat. So the fat Give it a texture, give it a nice juicy meat we're looking for. So I'm just gonna get a sharp knife and just cut it right down. So we just slice it in two first, because we're gonna slice it up quite thin. We don't wanna slice it up too big because we're gonna do a pepper pot steak. So we're gonna slice them like that. Small like that we're looking for people. Just cut them right in the groove of the fat because you don't want to cut them up too thick I cut them up too thick you're gonna take long to cook so you want to cut them up in this small strip here not too fat not too big Yes, people, just gonna add in the powder season into it right now. We're just gonna season up this buffalo meat. It's a beautiful recipe we do in Selvin Kitchen, guys. So just add in the season, just gonna mix in the season, the onion powder, the garlic powder, that all purpose season. Just get your hand down to it, guys. It's a beautiful, awesome, delicious recipe we're doing in Selvin Kitchen, guys. Buffalo meat. Anybody never have buffalo meat before, as I said, drop me a comment. Okay, if you look at it, buffalo meat is of the same texture, the same color like beef. So I'm gonna do a awesome, delicious recipe for you guys today. And please give me a thumbs up for the video, people. And please share the video with your friends and family because Selvin Kitchen, we're always doing something new. So guys, I'm gonna leave that for 20 minutes, let that marinate. Yes, people, what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna add in the vegetable oil. As I said before, you can use any type of oil for your lightness, for your preference, for your taste. I'm gonna give that two minutes, but let that hot. Yes, my beautiful people, I have my vegetable oil, so it's nice and hot now. So now I'm just gonna add in the buffalo. So I'm gonna add in one batch first, let this batch burn off for around two and a half minutes on each side, then two and a half minutes on the next side. So totally five minutes I'm giving this. So when this one burn off completely for five minutes, then I'm gonna take it out 
and I'm gonna add in the second batch. It's a beautiful recipe we're doing in Selvin Kitchen, people. As I said before, anybody never have buffalo before? Anybody never heat buffalo meat before? Please send me a comment. Anybody have buffalo meat before? Please send me a comment, send me. And guys, please give me a thumbs up for the video. Cause when you guys give me a thumbs up, it helps a lot of people. And please hit the notification bell. Buffalo meat in Selvin Kitchen. Yes, my beautiful people. So it's buffalo in it for the last two minutes. Just gonna give it a little stir if I want it cook evenly on both sides. Give it a nice stir. So I'm just gonna burn it off a bit for around five minutes, two and a half minutes on each side. And this is the first batch. This is the first batch I'm doing, so I have another batch to do. So this is a beautiful recipe we're doing in Selvin Kitchen, guys. Buffalo pepper pot. Beautiful, nice recipe. Yes, people, so I just changed my pot. So this one now, I'm just going to put in the second batch. Yes guys, so this is the next um, one what we're doing right here. So I finished the first batch already, so this is the second batch. This is a beautiful buffalo meat, people. Anybody never have buffalo meat before? As I said before, drop me a comment. Let me know if you have buffalo meat before. And drop me a comment if you never have buffalo meat before. You can drop me one and two comment, no problem. Beautiful recipe. So pepper pot, buffalo, we're doing in Selvin Kitchen today, guys. Awesome, delicious recipe. Okay, you know, guys, when you come on to Selvin Kitchen, we're always doing something new. Beautiful recipe in Selvin Kitchen. I wish a few guys was here to try some of Selvin recipe, what Selvin doing. And guys, please give me a thumbs up for the video. And please share the video with your friends and family because Selvin Kitchen, we have a lot of awesome, delicious recipe coming out, people. Beautiful recipe. Look at that meat. That meat. Oh my god, that meat looks juicy. Yes, my beautiful people. I just add in back the second batch and the first batch together. So the first batch, I give it five minutes. So two and a half minutes on each side. So totally five minutes. So then I add the two of them together and I'll give it a nice look mix to just mix and all of the buffalo meat to combine with each other. People, I wish a few guys was here to smell it. So now I'm just going to add in my grated ginger. So when I add in my grated ginger, I'm just going to add in my grated garlic, four cloves of garlic, and then my finely chopped two medium size tomato so after i scrape put my two medium size tomato in it i'm gonna give it a nice mix i want to, that tomato that ginger the garlic to combine with a buffalo meat people beautiful delicious recipe in selvin kitchen guys as i said before you guys never have buffalo meat before still drop me a comment anybody want to be a patron i'm gonna drop the link so you can sign up the guys to be a patron so give it a nice to mix now i'm gonna have the lid on it i'm gonna give it another 10 minutes to go and cook and then after i'm gonna add the rest of the ingredients in, in the buffalo meat yes guys so this add in the tomato i did add in the onion the last two minutes let that cook down a bit just add in the fresh times as well if you don't have the fresh time they can use the dry time people it's the same flavor the same taste you get another that fresh time like you would have the the dry time so cooking it out nice and now i'm gonna put in the ice sauce and the soya sauce let us add a little bit of water to it add a little bit more water to in the, get out all of the soya sauce and ice sauce
We want all of that season to combine with that buffalo. We give this another two minutes before adding the rest of the seasoning. Put on the lid on that, people. Oh, you want to smell that. Yes, guys, so what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to add a little bit of boiling water to it. Going to run a, a cup of cup and a half of boiling water. I'm going to let that cook down for around half an hour before I put in the rest of the seasoning and everything in it. So add a cup and a half of boiling water to it. Yes, people, so this has been cooking down for the last one hour. For the last one hour, that's been cooking down, people. Give it a nice stir. I'm gonna just check the, the buffalo if it cook. Just you oh nicely, nicely people. Yes, it's been cooking on for the last one hour, people. So now I'm just gonna add in the bell pepper. As I said before, people, when I cook in my food, I like my food a little bit of color in it. I don't like to heat up plain food with no color and nothing like that on it. Let's give it a stir. It's a pepper pot buffalo people. So now I'm just gonna mix up a little bit of flour. This is a fork I had a little bit of water in it. As I said before, if you don't have flour, you can use the cornstarch instead of the flour. So now I'm just going to add a little bit on the that side, give it a nice little mix, put some in the middle, you don't want to put it and leave it and you don't mix it, it's going to get lumpy, a little bit on this side, add the rest in, give it a nice little mix up same way, I'm going to mix in all of that flour, all of that bell pepper. And then the last thing now, I'm just going to add in the spring onion. So I'm going to give this roughly four minutes, people. A kind of beautiful pepper pot buffalo. Lovely. Yes, my beautiful people. So I just put in the bell pepper. And look at that, people. Beautiful buffalo pepper pot. Beautiful. Yes, my beautiful people, this is all finished now. This is buffalo pepper pot in Selvin Kitchen. Guys, if you never tried buffalo before, please try it. And anybody ever tried buffalo before, send me a comment and let me know. And anybody never tried buffalo before, please send me a comment and let me know. Same way, guys. Because you know that when I come on to Selvin Kitchen, we have some awesome, delicious recipe coming out. Because serving kitchen, we cook for everybody, guys. We don't cook for one nation or that nation. We cook for all nation. Okay? So please give me a thumbs up for the video, guys. And please share and like the video. Because serving kitchen, awesome, delicious buffalo pepper pot. All finished.
Yes, people, this is all finished now. This is the buffalo pepper pot. It's a beautiful recipe in Selvin Kitchen today, guys. And please share and like the video with your friends and family. And please hit a notification, people. So when Selvin Kitchen posts a video, you guys will get it. Because Selvin Kitchen, we're always doing something new. Anybody want to be a patron? I'm going to drop the link. You can sign up to be a patron. Because Selvin Kitchen, guys, beautiful, delicious recipe in Selvin Kitchen today, guys. So. Please give me a thumbs up for the video. I will see you guys in the next video. Stay safe. Selvin Kitchen.